So in this question, we have a classic question of polarization that involves the law called Malice's Law. So again, having read the question, understand the question, it's really helpful to draw a diagram. So I have a light beam with a certain intensity that I'm going to call E0. It's going to pass through two filters. I'm going to have one filter here and one filter here. And we know that we have a sensor at the other end that is going to pick up the intensity. Now, the intensity of the entry value is given as 6, and it's 6 candela. Now, we know the end here is 1 candela. So what I now need to do is what is happening from here to here, and therefore, if this is arranged in the vertical, what is the angle here that we're looking for to work out that why we have 1 candela? The first thing to know, remember, is that as it enters the first polarizer, the light intensity from here to here is half. So now what we have here is I1, and I'm going to give that a value of now 3, because the polarizer cuts the intensity by a value of half. Therefore, we can now work with Malice's Law. Now, what is Malice's Law? Malice's Law says the intensity that you receive is the initial intensity, which is our I1 in this case, multiplied by the cosine squared of the angle between them. So now if I rearrange that, I get cosine squared theta is equal to, in this case, our I over I1. Now this is 3, this is 1, so that is equal to 1 over 3. It's not rocket science to show that they therefore cos the is equal to 1 over the square root of 3. Now that gives us an angle, in this case, of 54.7 degrees. And there is polarization using Malice's law.